Hello, welcome to my channel. I'm so excited you're here to practice some Beethoven. This is the Egmont Overture and it's arranged by Robert McCashin. So let's begin. Let's tune first. Okay, so uh, we'll do inside and outside. So the outside players, you can start in first position or third position. And you're going to start with a nice strong sound. Make sure, of course, you're going to breathe and always place your bow. And then we'll come back to place. Back at the frog. Back at the frog and go up bow. Okay, so let's do starting from measure two. One, two, three. Four, five, six. Lift in place. Lift in place. Up bow. Lift in place on the string. Freeze here. Okay, let's do the inside. All right, inside from the beginning. And breathe. Okay, excellent. So let's continue. Let's do two before nine. So one, two, three. So make sure we really do that swell. So we're going to have C touching B, then A flat. Be really careful about those pitches. And float your bow here. Don't dig in. Save your bow, slow bow, now use your bow, and come away, and surprise. Now same thing, from the string, place, place a bow, okay so here let's go to third position if you're playing the outside, replace the three with one, one, two, hold step, hold step. Okay, and then there, from there, we're in third position, here's C. And then let's just go up a half step. So where that would be, we're just gonna move up a half step to get us ready. So once you play that, don't move your hand, just do that little half step. So, uh, so, so we're going up to D flat, and then that will be a whole step to E flat. So let's do that next entrance at 13, one. So just those two, that's just a tiny bit higher, right? You could also think third position, C sharp, D sharp, as far as where your hand placement goes, right? So here's A, B, C. This is a tricky one to find, so I would practice that. Make sure you're really starting on the right pitch. So then we'll do four, three, half step shift, three, touching, four, two, one, four, two, one. And third. Make sure G flat and F really touch. Okay, so let's try that again now from 2 before 15. 4, 5, 6, 1, vibrate. Save your bow and then use your bow. Use your bow and then save. Rest, 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 rest. Now here, we're going to replace that F with a 1, and then whole step, half step, to find our fifth position, E flat. So 3, whole step to 4, 3, whole step to 2, touching 1. Okay, so right there at 17 and 1. Rest, rest. Now we're going to go one, ha one step down. So we're here. We're going to go to here with our third finger. Okay. You could also think of a C sharp in third position. It's the same thing as the D flat. So that's where your hand is going. So right there, 3, 
four, three, two, one, one. And then you're going down again. So now replace that one with three. So we're going to second position. Four, sorry, three, four, three, two, one, one. You can stay in position. Be very careful about your uh, whole steps and half steps. D, D flat low. Big reach. Okay, so let's do this now from 15. This is the top part. Everyone, I should have said this, everyone should learn top and bottom, learn both parts. Okay, so four, five, six. Vibrate thir uh, third position. Shift up to fifth. Rest, rest. Now, fourth position. Rest, rest, second. Stay in second. Stay in second. And then go to third position. Three, four, three, two, one. Okay, excellent. Now let's do the inside. So three before 15 will be in first position. So one, half step. Save your bow. Use your bow, G flat. Okay, so we want you to really play out in this bottom part. So let's do it even slower. So four, five, Six, one, half step, full step, touch, A flat, low four, G flat, low three, low one, low four. So that can all be in first position. Okay, so now at 16, I think we should be in third position. So three on F and F and G flat will touch, so one, and then shift down to second position, so D flat to C, there's your E flat, and one, whole step, whole step touch, stay in position, go to first position. D flat and C really touch. Now third position. A flat and G touch. Uh, that was third position. Now first position. That's an E natural. Back to third. Okay. All right. Excellent. Okay. Let's do 25 now. For the top, let's be in third position. So one. Okay, I should have counted you off. So one, two, three, one, and two, and three, and down bow, up bow, crescendo. And then we're going to do it really fast and back down to piano. Okay, and save your bow once you do the one, two, three, one, two, three, one. You can stay in third. Sforzando piano. One, two, three, one, two, three, one. Now do your swell. Rest. Lower half. That's off the string, so lower half. Now, for this, you could do first position. And all of these, you could also do sforzando. That's 
that's also okay in first position. So you want to do it where it's going to be the most in tune. Okay. Uh, I like the third because we're not crossing so many strings. Uh, I like the, the tone, but it's okay to be in first if you need to for that. Okay. So then on the bottom at 25, you can be in first position and then you're going to sneak in your bow change. Okay. So let's go to 25, uh, pick up to 29. So one, two, you do play the double stop. So get your finger, kind of a flatter finger, figure out where you need to be for that fifth to be in tune. Okay. So one, two, rest, rest from the string, rest, 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 C and G. The ride, then C and E touch, one and two, and then F and A flat is going to have to be in third position. So four, low two. All right. And then same thing for you. Before 42, you could be in second position. So one, four, three, two, one. Four, three, two, one. You could also be in third position. Do your swells. Or lastly, first position. Okay, excellent. Let's keep going. This is, of course, all much faster. The tempo there, uh, we're just doing this under tempo so you can get the fingerings and things. But if we do 56... One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one. One, two, three, one. One, two, three, one, two, three, one. Okay, so, but let's not do it that fast. When you're practicing, you can start really slow and gradually speed it up. You can put your metronome on quarter notes and then just gradually speed up each section, work it up to tempo, okay? Don't try to do it fast right away. So let's look at 42 now. For the outside, we'll be in third position. Okay, so one, two, lower half. Place. You could stay in third or go to first. A flat and B flat touch. Place up, down, up, down. Place up, down. Place. 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 Third position. Low four for D flat. You could go down to first there as well. It's very important you play all of the correct pitches. So D flat, A flat, D flat, A flat. Touching B flat. Let's try shifting this time. E natural, big reach to D flat. Touching C. Okay, so go over that really carefully. All right, let's do the inside now at 42. So we'll go to 43. So one, third position, one and two. Rest, rest, two and three, not touching. Rest, rest, you could do four and open. And then stay in third, three on F, low one on A flat. Stay in third, G, whole step, B flat. Rest, 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 
rest, rest, rest, rest. Vibrates. Okay, let's do, do, do one before 59, rest. Then you could go, I would stay in third. Two, three, sneak it in, up bow, one, sneak it in, three, one. That way we'll go back to our F and A flat, three and one. And then G, fourth finger at open E. Then you can go to first, low one and two. Sneak in a bow change. And you could shift to third. You could also do that all in, in third position. So three and four. Then two and three. And just spend some time tuning those, okay? So the rhythm there at 59. The other thing you could do is to start, if you're not in tune for your double stops, just play top or bottom. So let's do 59, what that would sound like. So this is bottom part, 58. One, two, three, one. One, two, three, one, two, three, one. Rest. Sneak in the bow change, three, one, two, three, one. Okay, until you work up to playing those in tune. Okay, excellent. Then we have more of this, let's see, let's go to 66 on the top. You can be again in third, first or second. And then... bottom part at 68. One, two. Okay, then the bottom has the pickup to 73. And then together we have down, down, place up, down, down. Okay, then we have to get to 76 here. This is tricky for the intonation. So for the top, if we're all in in third position at 73, two, 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 three, three. Uh, there's a few ways to think about it. We could think of just crossing over, so that would be B flat, F, C. That's third position still, right? So now we're gonna replace the C with first finger. And now think whole, st whole step, whole step, half step to get to our F, okay? That's fifth position. So let's play these pitches. So this is 76 F. Now we're gonna have whole step, whole step. Should have thought about that before actually. Two on D flat. Three on A flat. Don't shift. I don't want any of the meow sounds. I love cats, but I don't want it here. Four, two, three. Then shift to third. Go to your fifth position again. So you could think A, C, and then let's do C, D flat, E flat, F. So half step, whole step, whole step. Four, two, three. Then you can be in third position. Four on D. And stay in third, one, three on F, and then 89, low two, B flat. Okay, so for the inside players at 76, if you're in third position at 73, two, two, rest, three, three, rest. Now, B flat F, C, D flat, we'll touch that. So we're in third position, four, one, think of your spacing, three, two. Stay in third position. One, two, three. High C, high three for C sharp, touching D. One, two, three, four, one. Now you could go either way. You could do a two on E flat, like a think of G sharp, and then the G flat. You could think of one F sharp, two, three, one, two, three. Or you could stay in third position is also fine. So. One, low one, low four, low four. 
Okay. All right. Excellent. So we do have to get ready for those quickly. So at 73, rest, rest, get ready. One, two, three, float your bow back to the frog. Float your bow, start at the tip. No weight, fingerboard. And then back to the frog. Rest, place, ready, and ah. Uh, same thing, float. And one, two, three. One, two, three. Now save your bow, very slow bow. One, two, three, now use your bow. the up bow. Okay, so if I'm in third, I can just stay there at 95, but we'll get to that in a second. 89, the top has triplets. So one, two, three, one and a two and a three and a one and a two and a three and a one and a two and a three and a do this for Sando. all works in third position okay two on b flat three whole step half step two d flat which is across the string from g flat okay so i'm on the bottom okay so just figure out where those notes are and now let's do 95 let's try third position on the string one two three one two two Now we could also do all this in first position at 95, so let's try that. One, two, four, one, two, low three, low three. Really careful accidentals. G flat. Okay, then we're going to be off the string at 95. So one, two. Place. Place. Back to the frog. Back to the frog. Okay. All right, fantastic. Let's turn our page pages. Ah, there's so much more on the other side. Okay. All right. So now we get to 107. So let's try, I would, let's try down downs again at 107. So top has F and D flat touching. So, so one, two, three. your bow vibrates very beautiful sounds first or third here's third or G string float again sing beautiful sounds so here let's be in third position three Low one, D flat, low two, three, low two, low three, touching. Then C, that we were already here for C. And then for all of us, we could do three, four, three, two, without a big uh, 
probably best to do three, four. Okay, and on the bottom, same boing. We can just play your part to make sure we have all the pitches. E flats there, D flat. So 107. One, two, three. One, and two, and. Rest. Low one. Now we have D flat, low four, or low two. Ready, and. Rest. while the outside is playing that. So low to C, ready, and ah. Uh. Or third position, that way you're ready, C. All right, excellent work, everyone. Shoo, we're getting there, okay. 135, let's do some stretches, okay. All right, all right, we're doing, we're doing very well. Okay, 135, let's do this slowly. It's really important to get the rhythm here. This is very tricky. So because of the tie, we wanna think of the 16th notes. So. We wanna make sure we come up exactly from the tie. So let's try this slowly. One, two, Three E and a four E and a one E and a two. Rest one E and a two. Get your left hand ready. Here I would do second position two. One two three four. Rest two. Rest third. First. Staying first, second, okay, so first, then replace the A with a two, two, one, two, touching three for B flat, whole step to four, and then, oh, that's an A flat there, I can't see, that's an A, and we could do open A, and then go to first, that works, okay, all right, so you could also do that in first position at 137, I said second, which would be two, touching one, two, whole step to E, half step to F. You could also do, not, not as you're using open E there and having to cross strings, so you have a difficult for bow or more difficult for left hand. You can see what you sound better. Same thing at 139, you could be in first position. If you're in first there, I would do four, three, and then open, one, two. Because you don't want to go, you definitely don't want to do that. So four, three, open, one, two, four, three, open, one, two. Okay? All right. So let's try this. Then we have um, the the dugga dugga duggas. And let's do this. Let's see. Let's do it about this tempo. Okay, at 135. One, two, three, four. Don't accent the ends. Ends. Stop your bow. That will sound like if I use a lot of bone, it sounds great at this tempo. If I try to play really fast, it's gonna sound crazy. So, we want it to be like that. So, just to give you an idea for tempo, they said 140 to 144. Here's 144. Da, 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 da. So, one, two, three, four.
leave that though, but that gives you an idea that that is our tempo from here to the end. So we're going to, of course, work up to that tempo. So let's do, let's keep going. That is the same there. So let's do how about 147. Dugga, 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 147. One, two, ready, play. <laughs> practice this slowly. I'm going to turn my heater off first. Okay, it's getting warm in here with all this playing, all this fast playing. So let's do 157 slowly. Let's try it in first position to start. So 3 E and uh, 4 E and uh, 1. Triplet. So that's three sixteenths fitting into the time of, I'm gonna, let's see, fitting into the time of two sixteenths. So this is putting the metronome on eighth notes, so you can hear what that is. So three and four and one and two, up, up, very short notes, up, up, save your bow here. Now you can do first. Make sure that's really clean then. Or you can do third position so you don't have to cross strings. So one on G. Save your bow on the slur. Don't use or you'll be in trouble. Because I have to get all the way back to here. Short, short, slow bow. Now let's try it twice as fast. Da da dum bum bum ba da da da. We're still very under tempo. Okay, ready? One one fifty seven. One, two, three e and a four e and a one. And then here you could also be in first position at this section with these uh, triplets there. Okay, so let's do now the bottom. Let's do 161 so we can get the transition into the quarters. So one, two, three. 
three, four. E natural, E flat. Touch, E natural, low one, low two. Shift if you're in first, low two. And then regular, and sneak in a bow change, sneak it in somewhere, then your first position is fine, one and two, stop, shift, one, two, one. Okay, so there you're gonna hooked bow. So one and stop. One and stop. One and shift. One and and now down up down. Sneak in a bow change. And then you can do first position shift. Make sure A B flat and A touch. Shift up and down, or you could do second position. One, four. Okay, all right. So very good. Let's go to 189, all of us. Ready and. Position two, three, four, one, I think, or you could do an open. All right, so the counting here is one and two and three and four and one and two, place four and one and two, place, place and one and two, three and four. All right. Okay, excellent. Each time placing, always going to the frog. Okay, we got through it. All right, so now you're just going to work each tempo, each spot up. So you could do like 163 to 177 and then work on 177 to the end. Or you can also do smaller chunks and just gradually, very gradually with the metronome, working it up, up to tempo. Okay, happy practicing.